concert last night, getting out of hand, coming to blows as the lead singer punches two women. It happened during a performance by the punk band Screeching Weasel late last night at the Scoot Inn off 4th Street. Fox 7's Camille Williams joining us live now with more on this one. Camille. That video, unbelievable. Nuts. I mean, that, those were two women, by the way, that he was punching. It's unbelievable. But yeah, that, I mean, this South by Southwest has been absolutely crazy. But again, look at this video. He's punching what looks like a bartender there, and security's taking him away. We found some fans that were in the crowd, and they spoke with us today. Here's what they have to say. Scoot Inn off 4th Street was one of the thousands of live music venues for South by Southwest, roaring Friday night. But not just because of the music. Ben Weasel, the lead singer of Screeching Weasel, is seen in this YouTube video jumping in the crowd and punching a woman in the front row, who apparently hit him in the face with ice. You can see the singer held back by security, then starts clapping and giving thumbs up before he's escorted off the stage. Austin police were called out. Whether charges will be filed against the singer is unknown. Crowd start getting rowdy. Deepak and his brother Peter were one of the hundreds of Screeching Weasel fans who witnessed it and filmed it on his cell phone. Yeah, it's pretty nuts that they actually came out with an album after 11 years and... Then, you know, they go on a mini tour and then this happens. The band who's with Fat Records label performed in Dallas and Deepak says when he saw them there, he remembers the singer being very belligerent and complaining about performing at South by Southwest. I mean, he was just constantly going on and on about how much he hated South by Southwest and how, you know, label and the manager forced him. And, you know, it just seems pretty petty that, you know, being, the, being you know, at stature that he is in the punk rock community, He's still complaining to his fans. Deepak and his brother Peter say after Friday night's performance, they are no longer fans. I think he needs rehab. I think he needs anger management classes. The band that's been around since the late 80s just came out with their album, and this was their first tour in years. They canceled their show that was supposed to be in San Antonio today. James, back to you.